bisque off with Nutella crepe. Just got to give that a shout. Out. Backflip, lofting out, good amplitude. Oh, he survived it. The one and only Jordan Clark. 360 bar spin to drop. 720 on the first. Front flip on the second. Oh, the massive super massive grab. Something that they missed out earlier on and they just want to put into the, the spectator's eyes today. We've got Freddie and Wiggling to Booth coming through. The Superman Z grab! The Superman Tower! So that was a little throw down for the, to get into the finals for Dirt Wars. We didn't catch all of it because we were too busy watching the late ride. But um, tomorrow's the final, so yeah, keep watching, you'll catch that. The festival is finally catching up with me. I've got bags under my eyes. Feeling it, feeling rough, feel tired. <laughs> Now they got an Oasis tribute band hitting the stage. So we're gonna smash out some proper dad dancing again and hit the grassy dance floor. So what do you think of the rap pack? Pretty good, get the crowd pumping, don't they? Getting your shoes in the air, bit of a random one, but he said we remember it. Here's the next day, just done a bit of goodie shopping. Now I'm going to head to the dual slalom. Uh, just have a little go down there, because I've been filming it. I'm going to try and hit it for myself. Here we go. Go smash out a uh, dual slalom. Bar out there. Whoa! No! But that last corner caught me out. <laughs> Very. It's bumpier than you think. Back at the top. Try and redeem myself from that shocking run I just done. I'm gonna try and hit the red side this time. That last bit it does kill your speed. Whoa. So that was the dual slaloms. I mean, not as quick as uh, some of the people I was filming the other day, but I had to do it just to say that I've done it and it was good fun. And on the red line, I didn't actually miss any pegs. But next year I'm beating that time. This one just here. <laughs> Now I'm gonna go head up, see if I can find Rick doing his enduro, see if he can give us a little wave on the way past, hit the cross country, fun loop. And then later on, we got the Dirt Wars finals. So we're gonna see some pro pros smashing it down, doing some pretty tricks in the air, getting the wow factors out, and then see where we go from there. So all the enduro races are still going on and everyone's getting their times. There's the queue at the obelisk. So I can't hit that at the minute, so I'm gonna just go down the cross country. <coughs> camber, whoa, off camber, way off camber. Oh, that's a bit sharpish. Oh, stuck in the wrong <laughs> Oh, that can throw you out. <laughs> Going in blind, I have no idea what I'm doing.
tiny section through the trees. Nice. Oh, caught myself on that tree, shoulder. Sharpish for that. Oh. Thank you. Oh, you're all right. <laughs> What do you think of that for the cross-country course? It was quite speedy for me. And uh, yeah, the first bit was a little bit of a mech up, but I didn't realize the course, it was going in blind. Well, I'm going in blind to all this, obviously being first time at Marvel. Look at all these old retro ones. Retro mountain bikes, beautiful. Rodeo Capron in 2000. Oh, the old Sansa. Now, tucking is more effective than pedaling. So here comes Psyche Cade making her way down. Really powerful on the pedals, going as wide as possible, making all of the track hers. And Sophie Cade crossing the line. Finding Sam Gibson, number one. She's bumped Jason McCall to second place. So it's first. It's John O'Jones oh, downhill. Go. Come on, John O! First place for John O'Jones. First place for John O'Jones, fourth for Matt. Nice one, John O. Thank you very much, nice bud. Work. Appreciate it. Nice one. My legs are very tired. <laughs> John O, you qualified first. Really? Yeah, you Giant, a replica of the late 1994 bike ridden by John Tomac in um, in some amazing races, and from many people's bedroom walls <laughs> of that period, uh, I had a poster of this this bike being ridden sideways down a mountain. Also going on is the downhill for the rippers that is finished now, and I've had the questions about when the prize presentation will be. I didn't win anything, but I'd like the thought of it. So we tried to come down for Dirt Wars final, but because of high winds, it's been canceled. So look who I found. Hello, hello. Hey. <laughs> 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 no, no, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> yeah, nice work. So here come the final of the four cross medal time.
It's that you, you mate. Go on, you got this, you got this. <laughs> Oh, no chain. Chain's gone. Nice. Oh, Adralia snapped. Loose. Hi. <laughs> Go on. Go on. Oh, is it Williams? Oh, go on, go on, push! Ben Deacon, oh, oh, oh! Go on, go on, go on! Matt Hilly are then Ben Deacon. Oh, he does not do an endo as it strikes it. Go on, keep pushing. Our last corner. Ben Deacon. Nice work, Ben. Hey, I'll take that, bro. Yeah, definitely. I'm balancing the gate. Last man out. I was like, well, I just wait and someone's going to make a mistake. Like, That's, That's right. Oh, oh. Here they come, the four girls that Lucy was just with. Here we go, it's the final last race of the Malvins. National champions. Come on, Jono. Come on, Jono. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Oh, oh he's down. Jono's down. Oh, no. Oh, go on, go on, go on. Go on. Jono back up. Oh, taking third. Let's get you on that podium. Finley! 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 
a winner in the age 11 girls race. I've never heard of this girl before. Is it the daughter of that man there? I don't know. I think her dad was a bit of a BMXer at the time. Uh, and he actually brought this festival to light again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the one, the only, Poppy Gosling! Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's cool, isn't she? We also have coming along all sorts of other podiums, including the Dirt Wars podium, the Enduro podium. The world champion today raced three events, quad eliminator, dual slalom and downhill. And the rise of the most points across the three events are announced as world champion. So in third place for overalls for our two-year-old girl, it is Kaya Gibson!
In third place, we have Warren Beard. In twelfth place, Will Allen. Eleventh place, Carl O'Connor. Tenth, Zach Shilton. Ninth, Charlie Hart. Eighth, Aguilar Power. Seventh, Hamish Hanks. Just missing the podium. We have our little tiny rider, Ollie Galvez. So, first up on the podium, in fifth place, we got Joanne Whitehouse. In fourth place, we got Thomas Brown. Third place, we got Dan Wagstaff. So in second place we've got Patrick Coates. In first place, one of my big crew and a real nice all round guy. We got Will Griffith! Wanna get your photos? Well done guys, you want to grab the prizes, so yours, yours. Okay, so our pro riders, the showman. In 16th place we have Matthew Hamilton. 15th place, Ollie Wilson. 14th place, Reese Price Griffiths. 13th place we have Joe Aldridge. 12th place we have Harry Gascoigne. 11th, Akram Sweeney. And then the top 10, who would have been performing today if uh, the wind hadn't been picked up. So in 10th place, we got Roma Beard. 9th place, Rick Milton Booth. 8th place, Alfie Stevens. 7th awesome. place, Cam Crosnell. 6th place, jo Josh Croswell. Fifth place, Charlie Bowman. Fourth place, Zach Raymond. First up on the podium, we've got the smallest rider in our category. Do it up to common cell bikes, we've got Phil Davis. Second place, showing the old school is still cool. We've got Freddie Palmer. Now in first place, this guy seems to be able to throw his hand at everything. Seems to be the answer to the UK's R. Willie. In first place, we've got Jordan Clark! Okay guys, if you all want to look towards Jake's minutes, we can get our shots. Okay, thanks again to everyone who uh, came over and watched the jumps. <laughs> the next thing for us is to move on to the National Championships prize presentation. And then our winner today with 15 points, which is basically three wins and a second place, Sam Fairburn. So there is our junior non-championship podium, Field Kickstock, Charlie Francis and Sam Fairburn. In third place, Harrison Stonefield. He's there. In second place, Melissa Lakes Bikes, Burles Bike Park, Felix Williams. And our winner for the men's juvenile category, Ree Darley.
other guy companies don't pay for the podium. TT have paid for the podium. TT guys are allowed on the podium. So there we go. Our Mel you podium, Freddie Robinson and George Cornwell. Cornwell, sorry. Place rider Ruben Hasberger. So here's our silver Ruben Hasberger and taking the gold, Jack Sherrington. And in second place, Ben Deacon. Okay, I've just been told the oi oi raffle is after this over there. <laughs> Always getting the plugs in is Mr. Deacon. And now for Identity Bikes, our Masters National Champ, Matt Hilliard! <laughs> See, that's how he's going. He's down next to the podium, so there's not a big walk on. So there's our Masters podium, Simon Nash, Ben Deacon, and Matt The Stolen Goat SBC Cycles, David Sibley! <laughs> I knew it was doing me out. It's like hard work. <laughs> In second place, Mike Taylor! Oh, it's a small child. He's won the silver medal. No, it's a small child's back away. <laughs> And our winner today, Aidan Bishop! It's not a GT, it's not a GT, it's not a GT, it's not a GT, it's You pay David for the right sponsor prices, you get on the podium. Right, so there we go. Once he gets up there. Our veteran men's podium, David Sibley, Mike Taylor and Aidan Bishop. Who's it going to be? Somebody who deserves it, says Cy. <coughs> Does he have someone in mind? He's yeah. walked past us, so I thought we deserved it. Subjects did not tell you the British cycling like, connoisseurs will get into trouble. We're going to go slightly broken. Right We're going to call up a grand bet. Second place in the elite, but this way she gets a gold medal and a jersey. Don't tell, don't tell the British cycling like, connoisseurs. Can we have Rebecca Booth up here? Yeah! The British cycling like, yeah. connoisseurs are the <laughs> We have Alice Taylor! Yes! 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 Yes!
in second place, Layla Begley Tracy. And taking the win, Amelia Martin. Okay, so there is our female youth category podium. Alice Taylor, Layla Baby Tracy, and Amelia Martin. Bronze medal position, Jessica Greenhall. Okay, second place, Josie McFall. <laughs> and our female elite national champ, Sophie Kay. Yeah, this is Sophie Kay, the recent mother. Yes, two yeah. months ago, mother. <laughs> two months ago. Yeah. 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 For that, a new life and everything, and also for being back to awesome in just a moment. Both moms are still in bed. So if we've got to get that national jersey on, yeah. Also, once we're done, can we get all the national champions back for a national champs podium place graph, please? It is another child size one, I apologise. <laughs> okay, so there is our senior female. <laughs> Step of the podium, please, for Stu Hughes. Bronze medal to you, the Stu Hughes. Yeah, there he is. Chris Smith is going to join in for the silver medal. Come on forward, Chris. Michael Parsons is going to join us as well for the gold medal. His total time is 350, uh, 5.56. David Guernsey is going to join him on the podium for the silver medal with a time of 5.33, so just three seconds slower, or faster on uh, But with a win of more than 20 seconds, Nick Bayliss did a 5.12. Let's give him and then still went from him that gold medal. Congratulations guys, Nick, David and Andy, your grand veteran winner. Sorry darling, I said darling, darling. And Ollie Squires, come forward for the gold medal please. Ollie did a 5.11 to Jason's 5.14 and Brett's 5.23. So Ollie, Jason and Brett, your hardtail podium. Men 
Junior. So we've got Kieran up there. We've got Reese. Now, can Todd Buchanan come forward, please? Because he did a 509. And after all four stages, he was just 0.2 of a second faster than Reese. So that was a very, very hard fought battle. All one on the last stage. Kieran, Reese, and Todd. Todd at the top there, your top juniors. Now, Men Juvenile. The bronze medal is going to go to Thomas Crosskick. Krausick? Krausick. I think it's Krausick. Reese Barlett will get the silver in a dropping world second beating. He did a 529 for the 540 and the 541 of his competitors. Dylan Hayes, Reese Barlett, and Thomas are your main juvenile champions today. For a bronze medal piece, having done a 511, that's very impressive. 5-11 for Joel Chidley, then Kenny Fuller is going to come forward for Silver. This is Joel. Kenneth behind him for Silver with 5.08. A 5.02 though has earned Kyle Hayes the gold medal in the Masters category. There he is Kyle. I recognise so many of these faces from the e-bike down here. Kyle Hayes, Kenny Fuller and Joel Chidley there. Language 32, George Delgano, Delgano. Freddie Kirkpatrick is our silver medalist, 10 seconds faster than George, wow. Freddie come on forward. But Kai Grokot is our winner with an immensely fast time, 5.04 versus the 5.25 for 5.32 for his rivals. Kai Grokot, where's he? Have you seen him around anyone? There he is, no? No gold medalist to stand on the podium? Well, silver and bronze, have a celebrate. <laughs> you made it to the podium faster than him. Let's go! This here, he did a 5.11.69. You'll see in a moment why I mentioned the 0.69. Richard Powell, is he here? Maybe not. Oliver Jones come forward for a silver medal, having done a 5.11.58. So 0.11 of a second. And Stuart Brereton. Where's Stuart? I know Stuart. There he is. He's our winner with a 5.09.27. So a couple of seconds winner for Stuart over Oliver. Oh, and we do have Richard with us now. Stuart Brereton, Oliver Jones and Richard Powell are your men's veteran podium. You've got a good support crowd. Noah Green. Come on forward, Noah. Five 526.29 second place. place. And Finley Woodley. Come on forward, Finley. Because a 519.11 was a good win there. Seven second win for Finley. With Noah and Daniel by his side, these are your top male youths today. Yo! And Julie should join her on the podium. Julie Rawl, a silver medal goes to her with a bar, uh, 658 for Julie. Ruby Edwards is our gold medal. This is she here. Yeah! Let's put Ruby on the top of that podium. Ruby did a 630.4. Smashed it. Absolutely brilliant. Ruby and Keith Hay. Give that silver Can we get that silver medal on it? Ruby, Julie, and Kitty. Wow, she's fast in second. <laughs> Ruby, Julie, and Kitty are your top e-bikers for today. At least we've got the top step of the podium occupied. Go on, Paulie. For a seven. Paulie Moore is your winner. Stay there. Masters winners today. 
Hey, do you have your photos? Go on then, tell me how it should be, Izzy. Still in Edis. Izzy Still in Edis is our women's senior champion. A gold medal to her, the top step of the podium. And, oh. Izzy is your top senior woman. She did a six thirty seven today. Give her that round of applause. Thank you so much, Izzy. I'm sorry that after all that I pronounced your surname. Go on. Modzaleska. Tallulah Modzaleska. And Georgina Griffin should join her on the podium in the silver medal position. Now Sonia Robin should join her on the top seven of the podium, please. <laughs> These are your top veteran women, the 40, 49 year old Sonia, Georgina, and Tawa. Thank you, ladies. Now we have just one more to do, and it's one gold medalist. Sylvia, you can the last one we need to do. Melody Griffiths is your top woman youth today, the 634. Fantastic time. Well done, Melby. We hope to have some more rigorous competitors against you in a future edition of this. Thank you so much everybody who stayed for the full 10th length of time for that. I know you've, uh, you've given a lot of respect to the riders who were last on the podiums there. Congratulations to all of them. We'll see you next year for a great Melbourne Stars to have a safe journey home. Much love to you all. Sorry, I'm going to Ben Deacon with the raffle. Right, we're ready. One oh one. Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, second prize can have a T-shirt. Nice. Yeah. There you go. One oh eight. Oh. Hey. Hey. First prize can have some grips, and then that's it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I actually can. Oh, I actually can. Need someone else. Please, Nate. Oh, Nate. Nate. Oh. Well done. Hey. First new one, get your ram, get your muck off. First new second, come see me a t shirt. Fair play, get your grip. Thank you very much. So that is the end of the Malvern Classics 2023. Oh my god, and it has been one hell of a year. But. I'll let it end with the man himself that organised this whole thing. The man, the myth, the legend. Right, thanks to everyone for coming to GC Bicycles Morvan's Classic 2023. It has been the party of the year, the mountain bike festival, the Glastonbury mountain bike. We're going to be back next year, August bank holiday again. Do not miss it, it's going to be bigger and better. Thank you. Nice one. Cheers, bud. Thank you. Is that right? Right. Let's begin the journey home. I don't want to go home. But it's uh, your birthday. Let's not remind me that I'm How getting close. How old are you going to be? Um, we don't need to put that being. Right, goodbye. <laughs>